I have a robe hook that I want to evenly distribute between this area here, but I want to have specific gaps on either end. So um, let's just get into this. We're going to show you how to use the uh, distribution tool. So I'm going to grab this. I'm going to use my multiple copy and I want to set that I'm going to create three copies of this object. Okay, so I'll just drag these out and I'm not too worried about where they land except for that I want them to land, you know, in a straight line. And then the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to use a line and I'm going to use this for an inference. So I'm going to draw this line and snap it from this wall on the left to the cabinet on the right. And now I want to bring this line outside of an area where there are other objects. Okay, so I'm going to just bring it up here to kind of the top of the screen. From here, I know that I want these robe hooks to start with a spacing of 10 inches on either side. So I'm going to go ahead and drag this in 10 inches and I'm using concentric. So I'm clicking on the line and then I'm holding my C key and I'm dragging this in and then let go of my C key, hit tab or enter, and now I'm plugging in 10 inches so long as polar is checked. So now I've brought this in 10 inches on either side, which means there's a gap of 10 inches on either side between the cabinet and that end of the line and between the wall and that end of the line, okay? So now that I have that, I can, I, now I've got contain selection mode in. I'm making a contain selection, selecting all of these robe hooks, and then in my edit toolbar, we're gonna see here a line distribute along line. I can click on that. As I hover over this line, you can see that it's noting that we're actually utilizing this line for that tool, okay? And then it asks me, do we want alignment to be, just put this in a center screen, do we want this to uh, align on centers? In fact, we do in this case, but they're already aligned, so I'm not too worried about that. And then distri uh, the distribution. Do we want to space evenly or do we want to dis uh, distribute centers evenly? Either one will work in this case. I actually want to distribute centers evenly. And then are we going to distribute to the endpoints or distribute between the endpoints? Now, between the endpoints, um, we'll distribute it evenly, taking into account the full length of the line, meaning that it's going to leave a gap at the ends. Now, I didn't want that because I wanted a specific gap at the ends. So instead, I'm going to distribute to the endpoints. Let me go ahead and press OK, and you're going to see here that these did, in fact, distribute evenly to the endpoints of my line. And there we go. They are perfectly centered in between this two area with a 10-inch gap on either side, and split evenly across that bounds.